Why would I be making it up? Because you want rid of me. I mean, you don't seriously believe any of this stuff, do you? I'm finding it hard to imagine. Thank you. It's just a misunderstanding, and I can't blame Lachlan for getting it wrong. I know what I saw. Which was what, exactly? Us talking. Yeah, they're really with them there. Only because I walked in. You know, you need to be careful about the kind of accusations you're making. So they weren't actually doing anything? Can we just calm down everyone? Because I think that he's just misread the situation. No, I didn't. You weren't there. Look, Robert has got his faults. He has many faults, but I will... I will say this, that when he wants to sleep with someone, he does it because he wants to, because he can't help himself, because cheating is in his blood. What's your point? My point is that you're not attracted to Dad, so you never would have slept with him. He'd do anything if you thought there was a big enough payout. I know you hate Robert, and lying about him I'm used to, but lying about Dad is taking it too far. What is wrong with you? Why can't you see what he's like? How stupid are you? No, just calm down, calm down. She doesn't need all this kind of stress. <laughs> Robert's right. Might have known you'd take his side. You can't see what he's doing. You're all over him and he finds it repulsive. As if he'd look twice at an old man like you, it's pathetic. Stop it. We know you're gay, Grandad. You don't have to live in the closet anymore, so why don't you just tell us what you've been up to with him? That's enough! I've told you before, there's nothing between Robert and me. And I will not be called a liar in my own house! I want you out of here. I think that's a really good idea. I think you need to go for a walk, calm down. I don't mean just a walk. He's not moving back in after this. I'm going for a drive. I want him gone when I get back. You can't blame yourself. I don't know what's got into him. Things... things are just getting back to normal. Still here? I know I'm right about you. But nobody believes you. Not even your mum. I don't see her running out here offering to come with you. Still, at least I haven't taken your car. You could sleep in that. Face it, you're lost. <laughs>